Okay, welcome back. In this video, uh, I'm going to be showing you how to uh, tack weld up square tubing to steel plate. So I've got a piece of scrap uh, eighth inch steel plate right here, and I've got some eighth inch wall square tubing right here. So um, what we're going to be doing here is, uh, first off, I haven't ground down the mill scale just because this is a practice that I'm just showing you. Uh, but make sure if you're doing anything that's uh, uh, you know that you want to look good or that structure will go ahead and grind off the mill scale. But the first thing we're going to do is we're going to put a tack weld at each corner, and then after we tack weld each corner, we're going to start the weld over here. And this is a T joint, just like we learned. So we're going to go ahead and start the tack weld at the first start the weld at the first tack weld. We're going to consume that tack weld, and we're going to work our way all the way to the next tack weld, consume the next one. Then we'll turn it and we'll do all four sides. Alright, so that's the, this is the finished weld, and as you can see, all the way around, uh, it's done a pretty nice job. I consumed all four tack welds, so it's one continuous bead all the way around the workpiece. And uh, yeah, so just make sure, uh, remember this is a T-joint, so you can use the horseshoe, uh, the horseshoe technique that we used, or if you want to pull it this way, you could uh, you could even use a uh, the, the cursive E motion that, that we learned as well. So just do a cursive E motion all the way down. Uh, practice both. Uh, you're going to get different. Uh, one of them is going to be nicer than the other, which you're going to find out. But you're going to find the technique that works the best for you. So whatever technique works the best for you, just stick with that technique. So uh, that's going to be it, and I'll see you in the next video.